Hey, 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 this is the Boat Doctor down here at the California Kurtz Boat Ramp Dock. Yes, sir, Bob and Big Jim over here and little, little Staby Baby, Baby Staby. Uh, 1550, it looks bigger than 1550, doesn't it? With the little cabin on there, you got your front wind cover side, tops. i uh, definitely take that down if you're traveling. I, I'd even take them bars down, just swing them back. <clears throat> you unsnap that, or unzip it actually, and then this pops up, makes it kind of neat. You can stand out here and do some fishing. Already got the bracket for a bow mount trolling motor. Cleat up here, anchor dairy. Got two inch ball with a standard flip, safety chains. And then I normally, I wouldn't tell you to do this, but I'm gonna do it. Just make sure that's on nice and tight. Ah, navy gray, baby. Backdrop, fillet table, ladder, load guides, gear bath oil hubs, brown good, white bad, make sure they're half full, three quarters fine, not anything below a quarter add. And there's a little hex head right here, that's how you fill it. You get the trailer nice and level, gear oil is 90 weight, pour in there, it'll get it in the half mark, walk away for 15 minutes, come back, don't overfill it. Green is nitrous, you don't have to run that, that's just in colder weather for moisture, it doesn't freeze up. 70 horse has plenty of power for this little boat. It's gonna scoot right along. Fuel injected, you got a 13 by 15 pitch prop. There's your flusher, you put your flushers onto that. You got your trim button here. Then you got drain plug, that's for the chambers actually chamber chamber and then you got your so it's three chambered boat then you got that's for the deck you got right here is your primer bulb so i might as well prime it see if they did their job okay i'm so then how to check this is your oil drain and i'm trying to there it is i'm gonna trim this down just so i don't forget it this one you can plug. So if you carry an extra portable tank, then what you do is you take this and pop this in there. And it primes it faster. There. So one more hit and it should. There you go. See, so I figure I'd just do it from loading, taking off. There we go. Now we're going to start getting it. I can hear it coming out of the tank. Stubborn little thing. And of course, I'm left-handed. There, now we got gas. Then you plug this baby back in again. Make sure that ain't kinked up. Gas lines don't like to be kinked. There you go, that's nice and tight. Cup holders, tackle, pull holders. That anchor light goes there. Gear bath oil hubs again. This looks nice. Got a bait tank, that's your shut off valve. Right down there, wash down hose, battery. Got your 703, you got a tack. You got your fuel management. Fuel, fuel, I put 10 gallons of non-ethanol. <sighs> here's your overflow for your bait box, Icy Tech coolers. Your little seat cushions are there too. So now we're gonna put it in the water and go from there. But what I'm gonna do is hit the bathroom first and then I'm gonna record again. So I'm gonna stop recording. 